Good afternoon, and what is a warm, bright and sunny day. It is Friday the 7th of April. I have a nice hot cup of tea. It's good Friday. And I have parcel to unbox. So, let's get the knife on this. Slide it open. in plastic and that's the problem so um what i have got is this which is the drop and the list uh, by mick heron and it's two slough house novellas um so old spooks carry the memories of tradecraft in the bones and when solomon Dalton sees an envelope being passed from one pair of hands to him to another in a marital bone um cafe he knows his witness more than an innocent account encounter but in relaying his suspicions to john bachelor who babysits retired um, spies like solly he sets in train events that will alter lives a drop in spook parlance is the passing on of secret information also goes is also what happens just before you hit the ground also includes the previously unavailable novella the list um so if you are um reading the Slough House series of novels which I'm kind of beginning to pick these up again after my partner has got really interested in them and this is why I found this to um, give to her to read then um, this sort of comes in between a couple of other of the books so it's sort of like I think it comes in sort of like comes in between deadlines and real tigers and then real tigers and spook street so it fills in between sort of like the um, third fourth and fifth kind of books in the series um basically adding extra details good things going on on in the background and um seeing more of what of the activities of the regulars of slough house are up to um now slough house is series it concerns a um it's a, a a group of washed up uh, sp spies um who have been put out to pasture now, for whatever reason, they, they've screwed up a training mission, um, they've become an alcoholic, um, they uh, possibly um, uh, to, did, an, a, 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 did something wrong, but it couldn't be proven, so it you know, couldn't be trusted anymore. They're sent, uh, the, the, but the thing is, they're not really any use. They can't be trusted, but they can't be got rid of. So they are pushed off to Slough House, to keep an eye on where they can do make work until the end of their career or they actually physically decide you know they decide i'm going to quit um and um so it's a book about no hopers and there they are overseen by the um gloriously um how can i put it gross jackson lamb who uh is ne you never learn out sort of learn why he's been put in charge of the slow horses um but um but the thing is, he 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 treats them as sort of like he says, you know, um, you're all bloody useless, but you're my, you know, um, um, but you're bloody useless and you're mine. So you know, um, he looks after them in his own way, um, even though as um, you know, he walks around in in in, in socks with, uh, um, which 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 need darning. Um, he smokes, he farts. Um, at, um, he he you know he's messy in the office. He leaves takeaways. Um, he is a misogynist, um, terrible character, um, but I'm sure he's incredibly funny, f funny to watch on TV. Um, so yeah, and it's his stories about these spies, um, you know, who could just do nothing until the end of their career, or they could actually decide to, um, well, go and do something special. And essentially, and they find clues and things. That, you know, they have been trained as spies, so they, they spot things. They they they, they get noticed and. Um, so they decide to investigate when they shouldn't and that's where the story comes in because they will investigate stuff that the service uh, you know the, the, the people whom they should be working for but but can't aren't interested so yeah and that's where the tension comes in so this fills in um, a bit of the story in between those books uh, you know and um, I think I've already got sort of like I think I've got the drop um, in, in hardback for when it came out but it's basically grabbed it in paperback because at the moment i can't find any of my copies of the books because hey 
um, I have all but an impossible library as, it's, as it goes. So my partner can read this, and this essentially is it's 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 Easter, and uh, this is what I'm giving her with along with the other books which she wants to read. Anyway, so uh, I do hope you've enjoyed this unboxing in the nook. If you have, then please do click on the like button down below. And of course, if you've got any comments and feedback, I do appreciate you taking the time to post those. And lastly, if you want to be alerted to more unboxings, look where you will see me out here, typically with a package containing a book or game, or in this case, um, a, a novella, um, which I will unbox and um, chat about to the best extent of my knowledge for roughly 10 minutes or so. All, of course, if you want to buy a nice little cup of tea, then please do click on the subscribe button down below. Thanks again for watching another unboxing look. Be back again soon with another one. Bye for now.